and what is going on YouTube. Man, I have no idea what's happening with my equipment. I've already recorded this this commentary. The the movie the the clip that's in is eleven minutes long, so it's two games worth. I recorded about five, six minutes worth. Finished the commentary as the game that we lost. By the way, we lost. It was a good game though, we were very close and we got some wicked rounds. So I'm trying Jade Rabbit here. I've been pushing around with Supercell at Monte Carlo to try and compete with the Doctrine of Pass Passing of Doctrine Doctrine of Passing. Or Doctrine of Passage. Uh just pick up some sniper ammo there. But I thought I'd switch it up a bit, try the Jade Rabbit. Um I, I wish I wish uh, I could play with something other than the two assault rifles I'm using, but nothing can compete mid to close range. Scout rifles certainly can't. Uh, and we've we've we're quite aggressive as a team, so I'm playing with my boy Jay and Cosmic again. Uh, and we've got a really good rapport with each other, considering we've only just met each other off the communities. Um, but we're having a, a well, we've been having a great time. Trials has ended now. Unfortunately, didn't get a single weapon over a hundred games played. Not a single weapon drop. Watch this for a snipe. Do I get it? Do I get it? No, I'm told. Yeah, I'll cut that for a snipe. Oh, sorry, I do make a couple of shots like that, and I'm sure I get them. Um, but yeah, tactically, it's, it's about getting that sniper ammo on that on that first round, if possible. And I'm on. I've only been sniping for two days in PvP. Well, two days. I say it's a couple of hours total. Whatever hundred hundred odd games is over the last three days. Uh, but boom, get home, son. That's what I'm talking about. See, I was always, always worried about sniping. PvP. It always seems like it'd be difficult, but it's not that hard. And oh, another one. You know, I didn't get the guy that got revived, but I, that strategy for me is so frustrating. I've been on receiving end of that three shots in a row where they just pre aim your head, you get revived, and you're down. Like, you should, you should, I mean, I know they get a slight bit of immunity, but it seems like they can time it very well and I've, I've been like dropped three times in one game now I'm not I don't have bad sportsmanship I know I'm teabagging them both I'm only doing it to try and get in people's head just to start frustrated you know getting frustrated I don't actually mean a disrespect by it um, but I know that people do it to me and they, they're just dicks about it I played a team of three earlier uh, we had a 318 a 319 and a 316 using doctrine of passing highlight level can do more damage and take more damage and it was a we lost we only just lost five three we lost which seems like a pretty comfortable win but every single round was was um very close i got a message after the game called me a noob and i'm like well first of all i was red barring which really caused some issues with lag second of all lower light level can do far less damage and take it so i messaged him saying i explained that i were had a connection issue and that you guys are higher light level uh I said, drop drop your light level and play me again then. Not a single response. Ooh, get, oh, what a pick there. Get on, son. That's right, bullseye. That's right, baby. That's right. Uh, I think I think I'm going for revive here. I'll put a nade in, try and soften them because they get the revive. Oh, but I'm, I'm, I'm really surprised. That overshield's a son of a bitch. You know, this is where the Jade Rabbit is just totally outclassed by anything. Like, I can't get any shots in that close range, slow rate of fire. Unless you can do a double body tap and a headshot, or one body shot and a headshot, might finish him, I'm not sure. So I'll quickly swap, because I realise that, yeah, there's no chance. I've been using Supercell on the, on the chance that, um, that together you get the the arc proxy damage. And it does it quite regularly, it procs quite regularly, but um, the Munch Colors has got a faster fire rate, so I've switched to that uh, for a lot of my games and seems to be working quite well. But, um, oh, miss, miss. Oh, ow, get on, son. You can't hang, bro. <laughs> yeah. But, um, I just I just want that pass, doctrine of passing because I have lost so many gunfights to that gun, even though. Ooh, get supered in the face, merciless. Is that five in a row, merciless? I don't know. Get, go for it, revive it. I think we lose this round. It's a, it's good because I, I go, oh, look at that. That's that aim resist, man. You know, it pushes you, it pushes you, um, your sight off the enemy. And I just screw this up here, like red health, going for melee, he's got an overshield, I miss my melee and then get bitch slapped in the face, and boom, I'm owned. And that's it, round over. Good good play on their part, some revives, some uh, good play. I get I get Your set on fire with a grenade, which caused my time, health to dissipate there. But, you know, this is this is one of those matches we lose, but we have a, a good time playing it. It's a, cl it's a close quarters game. Your team is behind. And I'm, I'm loving this uh, thousand yard stare. I've got to say, um, I'd like to use the spindle, but to be honest, 
I'm so used to how this handles. Ooh, see what I'm talking about? See what I'm talking about? <laughs> Get face palm, son. Well, I'm so used to using this sniper that, like, when I switch over to the spindle in PvE, I'm not trying it in PvP, but in PvE, I, uh, oh, look how close that fight was. Look at that. Oh, damn it. He should have had it. My boy, come, my boy Jay comes in with the hammers and finishes some. Oh, look at all those kills now. Damn. But yeah, the spindle light in PVE, I struggle to handle that sniper. It feels heavy compared to the uh, thousand yard stare. It feels like a heavy sniper, if that makes sense. And I struggle getting headshots on big target bosses, so I'm a little bit worried about attempting uh, PVP sniping with that bad boy. Um, I don't know whether it's. I don't know if it's that necessary. I mean, this has got Firefly on it, so it makes it decent if they're together, you know, a fair bit of explosive damage. But, you know, chances you're getting three headshots with a spindle on PvP are very slim, so I'm not that bothered. Uh, I'll have to compare stats and I'll check it out and see what's what. So I think my boy Cosmic's pushing off here. And we always play back when we play together, because at the very worst we can usually trade a kill. So I'll just nip up and grab some sniper, but I know my boy is... Uh, oh, miss a shot, miss a shot. Ooh, do I get this next one? Boom! Headshot, son. Uh, and that's round over. Nice move. Oh, self-res. Speak too soon. I think we're getting finish him off again and another kill. Oh, I got an assist on that. It's all good, though. Assist count. They work. It's all good. It's all towards the win. But I do get a lot of assists, you know. You think you should win. You know, like you're smashing a guy and you think you've got the kill and then your teammate just finishes him off. You're like, no. Uh, Spawning in there with the bats. Using the ram on the Void Walker. Try and get that extra bit of armor because... I'm going constantly going up against higher light levels. Oh, what a good snipe, man! What a good snipe! I thought I used to wonder how people do those shots, but I've had some. I've made some wicked shots. People blinking across the map, and I've managed to drag scope into the face midair. Um, uh, that was just a wicked shot, though. Um, yeah, going for those picks straight off the the spawn are a good idea. If you can get one man down, what I'd normally do as a tactic overall is I'd I'd go for the pick. If I get a shot. I'd follow up with a, a nade on his body just in case the teammate's close by. I'm going to try and revive him. So they've gone for heavy, just waiting in for the. Uh, ooh, do I get him? No, miss shot. Ooh, 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 miss another shot. Oh, watch this. I see this missile coming in a minute. It's a good shot on this part, but you know, the truth, man, it don't have track. I see it. I jump. Oh, too late. Too late. Ooh. I was pissing myself in that because I saw that bad boy through the scope and I just couldn't get out of, out of the way fast enough. Uh, but <laughs> that was a wicked round. So uh, this is where these boys start to pull it back a little bit, and they do win. I think did they win five three? I think they win five three. I think that I think we've won the rounds. We win. Um, see see the gap in between that lamppost and that building. There's a shot I make on one of maps. I'm going to have to edit together some of my sniper gameplay because I'm so proud of it. Considering I, I don't I haven't PVP sniped until a few hours <laughs> of gameplay ago, um, but the uh, that shot in between there we're talking. The space in between the building and the lamppost is about the same size as the red dot reticle inside the scope. And I made a shot on one of my maps. I really wish I could find that bad boy. It was freaking awesome. So uh, we're not pulling round for the self res, uh, for the revival, because we know that the round they're waiting on the body. So I'll just jump in for a quick scope in, see if we can see what's what. And we'll push together. Make sure we push together. Always push together, guys. Uh, we are going up against three. I see him in there. Don't get the pick. Uh, I was kind of hoping he'd pop his head back round, but no luck. So what we got? We got my Nova bomb back, which I'm enjoying using. I tried the Arc dude, which is great on six v six, but you just you're too vulnerable when you're gliding around. I think personally, and this is a waste. Oh, he dives behind the wall. That's a real shame. This is a real bad play on my part. There's a guy sat on the wall, one on the stairs, one on the wall, and there's one behind this wall as well. So they're all three taking cover. That were a wasted Nova bomb. It was on target, but you know they made a good move, got behind the walls, and that's it. You know, round lost. So one more round that we do lose. I'm sorry, I'm spoiling it, but you know, I've already recorded this commentary once, so I know what's going to happen. But uh, yeah, I like that, that bat effect. I'm just trying to use stuff we got for Halloween because there's no delete option, which I find frustrating. So I'm having to use. Uh, stuff so take a quick pick at that that space between the lamppost and I always I always take a pick on that center runway see if I can get a head you know a headshot and get a first blood if I don't see anything I normally go for a sniper up top of these stairs they're the two main points I focus on when I've got sniper ammo uh, and this guy's pushing this far right building and we've got two up top staircase now how does this go down do I win do I lose Ooh, ooh fail a jump there 
I decided to pull back around. And the radar is nice, but, oh, you know, it's different. I'm so used to Call of Duty, um, Black Ops and Ghosts and Advanced Warfare. And this is quite, although it's an FPS, it's quite a different beast uh, in its own right. It's a, you know, with supers, gliding, shields, over shields, self res, resurrection, grenades that track, <laughs> you know, some unusual weaponry. Um, just, ooh, I think we're all a bit nervous. So, yeah, see, this is what we did wrong here. I think Cosmic got a bit antsy, and this is where we start to break up and we split up as a team. And this is this is how we lose, but essentially, like, you get a little bit impatient and you push on your own. Ooh, oh, do I get the shot? I do get the shot. Watch this. Boom! Oh, damn! I like that shit. So we've got a couple of guys on there. Nade in, over nade. Um, wearing the void, void fang vestment. So I got three Axion bolt grenades. Try and take this guy out here. Yeah, I think I screw it up. Now, I don't know what happens here. Does this guy lag a takeaway shield? I don't know if he lags or he wasn't. I don't think he was expecting to be revived, revived to be honest. Um, last one standing. Ooh, this is... Oh, you see, I didn't know if that was my teammate. I, I got confused. Anyway, that's game over. We lost, but it was a wicked game. It was a lot of fun playing. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, so thank you very much for watching on YouTube. I'll see you later. Cheers.